Johnny come lately again. Um, today, um, I just went to GameStop and um, and I got one of one of the upcoming games that just came out for the Wii. Um, I'm gonna show you guys. Um, I was really excited to get it, even though this part of this video was gonna be a rant on X Face review. Let me just tell you, Morgan Webb. Adam Sessler, I hated your review. Your review was terrible. You had absolutely nothing good to say in your review for this game. Nothing. Nothing. Metro of the M. It's the game I have. Metro of the M. Um, they had absolutely nothing to say. They said the controls are horrible and everything. Well, I'm going to go through this myself. And let me be the judge of my $50, okay? I, I spent the money, all right? You said the game sucked, and now I'm going to show you, all right? And first, there was Samus from Metro Prime 3. That's what you're going to look right there. Not too much good color quality and everything else like that. My foot's sitting there. First, there was Samus from Metro Prime 3. All right, we had her. And then... There was Metro Prime 3, again. Metro Prime 3. Metro Prime 3 Corruption. I will never forget you. I will never forget you, Retro Studios. You are gods. I love this game. This game, this game, I actually played this before I got, um, um, before I got Other M. So, this, if any of you don't have Metro Other M, go buy it. I don't care if you have to rob an old lady. <laughs> go. Go buy the game. Go get it. It's out now. Um, and then there was Metro of the M. I finally got it. I got it a little late than anybody else. Um, this is my only gripe about the game. When they did the game, all right, they they didn't do it as as detailed as you see in Prime Three. It's not the game. The game's not as detailed. In other words. It's, it's a little, it's a little, I was kind of disappointed with a little, a little bit of cartooniness in the game, but I'll let it slide. If, if they can, des if they can design it up to the quality, which I know Team Ninja can do, up to the quality for the next one, or much of the M2, or whatever they're going to call it, if they can design it up to that quality, man, I, they won't see any gripes, I mean, all the beams, all the powers, and everything else. And there's another thing that I had griped about it, that, that I didn't like, Samus Talks. I mean, Sam is just going in there with guns blazing and just shooting and everything. That part of X-Hater's review, I do agree with. But this game is awesome. Go pick it up. All right, it's time, to, it's time to unbox now. It's time to unbox this sucker. It's time to unbox. You guys can see me? Good. All right, we're taking it out. Out of the plastic for the first time. Neatly taking it out. Fresh. Clean this. I'm sorry, Metro Prime 3. I love you. I love you. I can't let another take your place. Prime series. If anyone if any if you guys don't have the Metro Prime the Metro Prime trilogy for the Wii, go out and get it. It's, it is a great deal. It is a great deal. I think now it's, I think now for the whole collection, if you go on eBay, you can get it for like 30 bucks. Which isn't too bad. Um, God, I love Prime 3 so much. It's going to be hard to let it go, man. I, ca I can't sell it. I just can't sell it. I, I have I have the original GameCube versions in my room. And it, it's just it's just too good, man. I mean, I'm going to miss Retro Studios, man. I, I know they're never going to ever go back to making Metro games again. But that's what made them good. This is the inside of it, the Dagon thing. You guys can see it. Hopefully you guys can see it's good. It's still good. This is the inside of it. Uh, this is uh, all the booklet and all that other crap that they got in there. And the nice and... Oh, crap. It's in color. Nintendo wasn't cheap. Holy bejesus. They weren't cheap. The book is in color, as you can see. Let me see if I can show you guys with the camera down like that. The, the book is in color. I know I have some bad lighting right now, and you guys probably can't see it put it up in my hand so you guys can see. This is what it looks like here. 
the book is pretty much in color. Goes through all the steps of how to use the controls and just everything, which is which I thought was kind of cool. But I hated the fact that Team Ninja said no nunchuck. I mean, I I hope I, they they said they said in some of the reviews they said that the game does feel a little clunky without without the use of the nunchuck. Half of the issues that that um, that are messed up in the game could have been re could have been resolved with with the use of the nunchuck. I mean, they could have used just used the just used the classic controller option, which would have been nice. I mean, that would have been great too. I mean, they just overlooked it. Team Ninja just overlooked it. But anyway, good job for Team Ninja. They got a bunch of beams here. Another thing that you can't do in the game that I was kind of disappointed about. I mean, they don't want to make it more want to want to make it like Metroid Prime Three, which I understand. But they should have made Samus move around in first person. She can't move. She's just sitting there. It's like she's stationary and she has to shoot. And X Play was like bitching about it. It was like, well, we keep dying every time on the boss battles. We can't do it. I can't do this. The controls suck. The boss keeps whooping my ass. I said, well, maybe you need to learn the controls and learn how to be a better player and stop being so sober at the Metro. I mean, stop being so bitter about the Metro Prime, the Metro Prime trilogy ending, and just learn how to play Team Ninja's own version of Metroid. I mean, come on. Let's be reasonable here. This game, this game looks good. I have been waiting for a Metro Prime 3 third person. When Retro did it, they did it like really, really good. It looks Samus looks looks more adult like in this one. She doesn't look like she's like kitty and like that or like a teenager, like in Team Ninja. But um, other than that, you're dealing with a pretty decent game. This is it. The whole thing in Spanish. Eh. I don't really care about that really. But anyway, that's pretty much the whole book. Oh, Dynasty Warriors 3. I am definitely getting that. Dynasty Warriors. I'm a Dynasty Warriors fan. Sin and Punishment. Haven't gotten that yet. Netflix. Yeah, I know they got that already on the Wii, finally. And um, that's pretty much it for the video. Um, hope you like my Prime 3 picture. I, I sort of I sort of did a did, did like a little copycat of a pic I found online and just drew it myself. Oh, this is a while, while back. I just wanted to just show that to you guys. I'm going to do one for other M and probably color it and uh, hang it on my wall. Other than that, um, and it's everything here. Oh, wow. They have the recyclable. That's the first one, Zendo. They actually put recyclable on it. That's amazing. Oh, my God. Recyclable plastic. All right. Um, that's pretty much it for now. And um, hope the video wasn't too bad where it affects my views. You guys don't watch me. Um, anyway, that's, um, that's it for now. Bye.